Hello, swear back in this time we have a nice laptop to repair. Acer Nitro i5 and RTX graphics. For some reason the charging light is always on. Pressing the power button, the laptop is coming on. I can hear the fan spinning, but no picture on the screen. So that's the issue with this laptop. Now let's check what the customer is saying. The customer is saying laptop suffered uh, liquid damage on the motherboard and does not always turn on. All lights appear fine and there is no error beeps. Occasionally turn on fine with no issue at all. You can see it's a lot of damage around the, the EC chip. Possible liquid damage. Looks like dust but can be liquid damage. So uh, the laptop is still on, we still have no picture. I will say let's open the laptop and let's try to have a look inside. We are looking for liquid damage. Yeah. Okay, so the laptop, it's open. Oh yeah, yeah, check there, check there, check there. Yeah, let's have a look. So around the EC chip. Yeah, indeed, uh, looks bad. I mean, we can see it's liquid damage. Even the battery connector. Okay, let's try to clean it to see what uh, what is going to happen. Let's see. Okay, doesn't work. So cleaning with alcohol is not working because probably something sweet. So we have to switch to water. Okay, so this is water cleaning. Yeah, this is pure water. But because the sugar is getting dissolved in water, it will do a better job compared with alcohol when it's about sweet liquid damage. And the battery connector. You see, it's just enough to leave the water in, uh, you know, the water, it will do the, the job for you. Let's absorb the water, probably it's sweet water now. More clean water. I mean, this, this easy chip looks like new right now, you can see. Yeah, everything is looking good now. Perfect, right? Yeah, let's dry with the hot air. Perfect. So what do you think? It will work or not? That's the question. Yeah, the ECHB is kind of hot. Let's cool down. Yeah, it's fine. So plug in the battery. And the charging light is not present anymore. You remember it was always on. 
pressing the power button. The laptop switch off and on. We reset the BIOS. No, because we didn't unplug the BIOS battery. So we still, we don't have picture. Hmm. Okay. We have picture, that's crazy. So actually that was the problem, I can't believe. Just uh, a little bit of liquid damage on the AC chip. Hmm. And it's working fine. Yep. Yeah. All good, let's plug the charger. Plugging the charger is taking 3.5 amps, which is fine because the laptop is on. Let me shut down the laptop. The laptop is off and is charging with 2.3 amps. Wow. Yeah, clearly the liquid came from the back, so it's no point testing, uh, checking the other, uh, the other side of the motherboard. What we can do, just to be sure, nothing wrong, it will happen in the future. Very simple, yeah? Unplug the charger, unplug the battery, and our comb is some liquid flux. So the liquid flux is liquid because of the alcohol. So uh, it will go behind of the chip, around every pin, and in a moment you come with some hot air, then the alcohol it will get evaporate, and uh, the rosin it will change the state on. Uh, being crystal, so it will isolate each pin. You see, the, the rosin is start boiling because the alcohol is boiling actually. You can see. And now, when it will cool down, it will be like crystal. I will show you, yeah? I will show you. Just wait. Just let, uh, let the laptop cool down. So you can see everything is covered with, uh, with rosin. You can see even between the pins is rosin. Even on the pins is rosin. But it's just a tiny layer. Check there how it's getting cracked. You can see. You can see so that's the logic behind of a liquid damage uh, repair i mean in order to stop the rust um, the only way to do it is to get rid of the oxygen so that's the idea behind you can see it's getting cracked exactly like glass What if I'm going here, yeah? Here? Check here. Same like glass. It's like uh, a layer of... Uh, like a protective layer. Rosin is a very good isolator, yeah? Check. Yeah. I mean, maybe it's looking a little bit messy because it's not clean. But that's the only way how you can stop rust. Uh, the other way to stop rust is using oil. But instead of having oil moving around on a motherboard, I really prefer uh, rusty. Now, let's test it one more time. Pressing the power button. And the laptop, it is coming on and it's working fine. Okay, good. So what do, do I want from you to keep in mind? It's use specific liquid for cleaning for specific uh, liquid damage. 
like on this case we have sweets yeah like anything sweet like uh, sweet tea coffee sweet coffee coca-cola or any other uh, you know drink which is sweet use water yeah that's very important you can't take that damage out without water for anything else including pure water damage you can use uh, alcohol okay i'm happy i helped this customer it's pretty sad to you know uh, lose a gaming laptop especially when everything is good but just die because of a uh, liquid damage on a, on the ec chip you know we have so many easter nitro on this channel i mean probably 80 percent from the gaming laptops i'm getting are acer nitro 5 and uh, don't get me wrong not because they are bad because probably they sold a lot okay perfect so i'm gonna stop here I will say uh, thank you for watching, you know, like, subscribe if you like the video. And uh, yeah, this was a lucky case. I mean, you know, on a gaming laptop, a repair has a very high chance to end bad. But yeah. So see you on the next one. Bye. Hey. If you find my content being helpful, don't forget you can support this channel by pressing the join button and you can get instantly access to our members only cool collection and uh, Discord private channels for support with your repairs. Also, you can have a look on our uh, United Kingdom uh, eBay where you can find some cool and unique products, United States eBay store or our Patreon page. Thank you.